What's up, people? We're here again. But yeah, I'm picking up my sister, and we're gonna go to prayer meeting. Just got out of the studio. It was really cool, and we were basically talking about the moves that we're gonna make for the future. And I'm on you now, streaming. What's up, girl? What's up, Helen? Hey, you two. Might not be able to see me, because I'm too beautiful, yo. On the road again. I can't wait to get on the road again. No. On the road again. I can't wait to get on the road again. Yeah, man, I'm about to go get a tripod from uh, Best Buy, because my sister does this little streaming thing on her Facebook page for all the messages that are on the church. Study to show thyself approved unto God, a workman that needeth not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. 16 says, but shun from profane and vain babblings, for this will increase unto more ungodliness. Hit us up, though. We turn, bruh, at this prayer meeting. Y'all finna just see a little glimpse of it, just to see what really goes down in a Pentecostal prayer service. It's just... A wonderful experience. People have uh, a crazy idea about it. I think they have the wrong perception about it. Um, Pentecostals and apostolic prayers, uh, prayer services. Um, yeah, people be speaking in tongues and people get really crazy in there. But you got to understand, if we really do go to that spiritual depth, then is it really that crazy to believe? You know, people say in decency and in order, but that doesn't mean everyone else's opinion of decency and in order. It's God's opinion. If God can make a man come from a, a woman without being birthed, to, uh, without, you know, having slept with any man, if God can do that, then, you know, that's something crazy. Joseph thought that Mary was crazy. Some people don't even believe in the virgin birth. The King James Version definitely says that Mary came from. But anyways, uh, we, you're going to see a real Pentecostal apostolic prayer services. And this is just a few of us that get together and we just pray. And we've been doing this every day for the past month, I think. And it's really been amazing. I can't stop going. I'm, I'm really addicted to it. For some reason, I've never been this addicted to it. Something happening um, because I don't have a consistent prayer like I want to but this is really causing me to so yeah check it out guys I'm about to pick up my sister and to me sister in that car there's Brittany what you got that thing up there are you alive yeah I'm not in there I'm not in there okay and I'm on uh this Anna. car just got one charger and I'm vlogging is your phone charged it's a record in heaven, the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost, and these three are one. And so, if it says that they are one, then so you gonna ask them stuff like the Trin like Trinitarian questions too, because they basically well, believe they like they similar to that. Jesus, God is not one. The last question I got. Oh no, that was part of four. First uh, John five seventeen. So if if the Father, the Word, and the Holy Ghost are good, you can't go through there. Yeah, I would just. <laughs> what did you say it was? Say something. What up? What up? What up? What up? You can hear me. Yeah. This is where the tripod stuff is. That's what I really want to want to get like a tripod for the live streams. She said that that way if she walk up in church you won't be scared. <laughs> Brittany leaving church cards on Best Buy counters. Amen. Like, Praise God. Like, oh yes, that's never gonna happen. Let me go. Let me go find him. <laughs> we'll be I don't know. Boom. A lot of way up there. Yeah. Ain't no cars here, bro. Jesus. Man. I'm gonna take them to see if they can. Oh. What are they doing here? Who? These people. Next door? No, I'm in there. Let me keep recording until I get out of the car. Oh, you just cleaning? I'm cutting thread coming up off the door. Oh, okay. The thread? Yeah. Tanya? She just left. Yeah. She just left? Okay. Yeah. <coughs> Hello, Sister Kim. Um, are you coming through? Okay. I'm 
good. How you doing, brother? <laughs> I was just trying to see who was coming today. Yeah, yeah. We just got here, actually. I don't know who. Uh, Kim said she got to work till 2 in the morning, so most likely she ain't going to be here tonight. <laughs> uh, Brittany is my sister, and me and uh, Mike. <clears throat> so, Brother Manuel, Kim, uh, Tanya left. So it's just me and Brittany, and Mike probably going to come, so we can go ahead and get it started. It's gonna be kind of crazy, but we got these little lights here. This ain't usually how we do it, going through the whole spill, like talking. Usually they're here, so. But let's do it. It's gonna be kind of crazy, so. Well, we had a good prayer meeting. Everybody went there. Uh, you know, Alfonso Taiwan couldn't make it either. But, um, you know, Mike came. Of course! It's not going to work. These people just cross the street whenever they feel like it. Well, it was me. Um, Brittany, Mike, my granddad came downstairs. So it was good. We just got to, you know, it was a real good prayer meeting, man. You know, me and Mike was, was talking for a minute about some good stuff, ways to pull people in. And that's what we do. You know, we try to pray every day because we want some move. We want a really mighty move of God to happen. And people might think that's just church rhetoric, but it's so serious. And I really want to tell people as much as possible, man. It's a really, it's a real war. It's a real battle that we try to go into and we just want to help people. So, you know, God bless y'all, man. Let's do it.